Hi boys and girls, I'm going to be doing a shared reading of one of your texts for today. This text is called, What is Pollination? What is your favorite fruit to eat? That fruit exists because of a very special process. That process is called pollination. Pollination makes it possible for plants to make new seeds. It affects all plants with flowers. Pollination depends on something called pollen. You may have heard of pollen before. Many people sneeze and get stuffy noses in the springtime because of it. But pollen is an important part of how new seeds and plants grow. For new seeds to grow, pollen has to be moved. It has to move from one part of a flower to another part of a flower. Usually it gets moved to a different flower. This process is called pollination. It can happen in different ways. Sometimes pollen gets moved by the wind. For example, corn has light and dusty pollen. It can get blown long distances. When its pollen lands on the right part of another corn plant, it allows new corn to grow. Other times, pollen gets moved by animals or insects. These animals or insects are called pollinators. Bees are one example of a pollinator. They come to a flower to get its nectar or pollen. The pollen sticks to the bees. Then, when the bees fly to another flower, the pollen moves with them. It gets dropped off at the other flower. Moving pollen may seem like a simple thing, but it's very important. Without pollination, we wouldn't have many of the fruits vegetables, and plants we have today.